Hello, it's Rachel with Big Adult. You are not too old for comics. You're never too old for comics. And we don't call them comics when we're grown ups, we call them graphic novels. Let's jump into five of my very favorite graphic novels. So, first up is a total classic. Uh, the book is Mouse, it's by author Art Spiegelman. Now, it's not exactly uplifting, kind of a downer. It's about the Holocaust and we all know how that one ends. It's written from Art Spiegelman. His father was actually in the Holocaust. And it's a really interesting story of his dad going from a successful businessman to ending up in a camp and being separated from his wife, eventually losing his child. It kind of splits between modern day and the past. One of the really cool things about the book, all the different races across the world are portrayed as different animals. Germans are cats, the Americans are dogs, the French are frogs. I learned more about the Holocaust from Mouse than I feel like I did from Diary of Anne Frank or Schindler's List or anything like that. I don't think there's been a college graduate in the last couple years in America that hasn't been given the book, Oh, The Places You'll Go. The book's got some great, if not whimsical advice to it, but if you want to get a recent graduate a book that's uh, still visual, but also a little more practical, I totally have to recommend this next graphic novel. The book is called Johnny Bunko, The Last Career Guide You'll Ever Need. It's done in this really kind of anime manga style, so it's, it's perfect for kids who are in that Dragon Ball Z and Pokemon. Daniel Pink is actually a really well-renowned career advice writer. He got this fellowship to go to Japan and they paired him up with this kind of anime manga artist and the two of them came up with this book together. So it's got this series of lessons that are tied into this whole magical plot line. I've actually found that the lessons I learned in it were as applicable when I was in entry-level positions as they are in managerial positions. Might I suggest skipping the Oh The Places You'll Go and, and get them something that's actually helpful and is also like in its own right a really great graphic novel. So don't let the title of this next graphic novel scare you off at all. Uh, the book is called Sex Criminals and it's by Matt Fraction and Chip Zdarsky. It was actually um, voted Time Magazine's Comic of the Year. The story centers around a young woman that discovers she has a magical power that she can stop time when she orgasms. The main plot revolves around kind of shenanigans she gets into in this soft time space. So if the last book had a lurid title and a pretty sweet plot line, this book is actually the complete opposite of that. The book is called Lost Girls. It is, uh, it is a filthy, filthy, nasty book. Uh, you may know the name Alan Moore from some other really famous graphic novels. He actually did The Watchmen. It's been made into a very popular movie. Billy Crudup's Wiener shows a whole lot in it. Uh, the story Lost Girls is nothing like The Watchmen. The Lost Girls is about um, Wendy from Peter Pan Neverland, Dorothy from Oz, and Alice from Alice in Wonderland. Uh, and the three of them, you know, meeting up and, and um, it just, just, this is a not safe for work moment right now. And finally, staying in the whole fairy tale vein, uh, my next favorite graphic novel, um, it's really a couple of novels, and it's the work by artist Junko Mizuno. She's done several books now taking on traditional fairy tales. So she's done Cinderella, she's done uh, Little Mermaid, and she's done Hansel and Gretel. Now, Junko Mizuno is one of my absolute favorite, favorite artists. She's girly, she's kawaii, she's feminine. I have all these super cute figurines by her. <laughs> Uh, she does these really amazing spins on the book that have a very uniquely Japanese anime manga kind of feel. Thanks guys so much for watching my roundup of my favorite graphic novels. I hope you found some new books that you want to read. If you have any graphic novels you think that I should read, put them down below in the comments. Would love to hear you guys' feedback. Holla at me. Bye bye guys. Rachel, big doll.